hello, hello, hello. I want to show you something really neat. And you've probably seen these. This is all you need. It's some glass plates, some beads from dollar store. And then you will need an old picture frame and you just put all that stuff and glue it on the glass. You can use uh, E E6000 or you can use a Gorilla Clear Glue or, and they work both of them very good and you just put the glass where and uh, uh, lay them in there and put the little beads around it and you just let it cure for 24, I mean 48 hours for each application like if you put the plates on first be sure you put them in the right place the first time and then put all the beads with the flat side down on your glass any kind of mint window i mean you know broken down window you can glue it together and clean the glass and just go to work i've seen some amazing things people have made i think this is one of the most beautiful one here and this one here is totally awesome. Well, okay, so I can't have a favorite. But you might. And it might be fun if you just find it. Well, picture frame. I think an old picture frame with just some things you can glue on it. You know, you don't have to put the back on it so the light can shine right through the picture frame on your items you have glued on there. Like pieces of glass, marbles. Oh, the sky's the limit, but I really just love it. Of course, I have no place for any of these things. I might try and make, uh oh, joke. <laughs> How'd they get in there? Oh, no, another one. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize those were there. And this was so pretty. I had to add this. Of course, all these other things that you're seeing or just pictures I like and I thought I would add it out so at least I'd have a five minute video for y'all to watch and think happy thoughts and see pretty things because it is what it is and today is our day and we're still here and we're special and look what fun somebody can have just a little bit of E6000 and uh, some marbles or glass or here's one just made up pieces of glass and I thought it was really really pretty and they hung it in a frame in their backyard isn't that cute I mean sky's the limit they are heavy though you'll have to use chains because anytime you put glass on glass yeah, I'm, sh I'm sure some of them are very very heavy but yes, look at that. Isn't that absolutely adorable? And here's one. She's got it in the house. So it shines through a picture window. Oh, and there's a, there's a snow cat. Aren't you cute? And then here's a little bullet hole kind of window you could just do. You know, just any kind of frame that has glass in it. And light can get through it. Oh, and I thought this was pretty for the 4th of July. And how pretty their little thing was and I put this out here for someone special that does a lot of little characters like that and uh, and here are some cute I thought these were excellent ideas of course I love to make flowers and stuff so and this I thought it was very unusual colors I love this and then of course here we go back to the dry pools it's just flowers aren't they beautiful what fun! Look at that one and that gray stripe or blue stripe in that pretty. Oh yes, I just think they're just that pop of color. And of course, if you don't want color, here's a muslin, and here's a beautiful table runner. I thought it was exquisite and cute little garden. Who, who doesn't like to look at a pretty garden? And there's that again, the frame. And you've got theirs hanging on a patio or something here. Oh, that, that was pretty. And I showed that again because I liked it. And this porch I thought was cute, how, how they got that dark blue 